the system that we need, the system that I want to introduce is one whereby if you come here illegally, you should be swiftly detained, and then in a matter of days or weeks, we will hear your claim, not months and years, and then we will safely remove you somewhere else. And if we do that, that's how we'll break the cycle. I understand, but, I've, but I've heard, so, I have heard this a lot, Prime yeah. Minister. So, so, what, so my so question for you is, yeah, so what are we doing? What are you tangibly yeah. going to, to do, do to enforce this yeah. and make it happen? So look, in the first 100 days, what have we done? What have I done? A, I've got a new deal with France, which is increasing the amount of patrols that are happening on French beaches, which is making a difference already. Secondly, I've got a brand new deal with Albania. Albania accounted for a 30% of all yeah, the illegal migrants. Of course that's ridiculous. But I've worked with the Albanians to put in place a new deal, which means for people coming from Albania illegally, we will be able to remove them safely back to Albania. And that is already happening. We're putting illegal migrants from Albania back on flights, and that will ratchet up over the year. And that's tangible improvement in the situation. That deal is a new deal. But the key thing we need to do is introduce new laws. And very soon we'll be introducing new laws into Parliament which deliver the system that I explained. The system which says if you come here illegally you're not really going to be able to stay here. Give me the simple explanation of what this new law will look like. So what that law will say is if you come here illegally, if you're an illegal migrant here, then you will not be able to stay here and in fact we will be able to detain you. And then we will hear your claim in a matter of days or weeks, not months or years, and we will have the ability in the vast majority of cases, to send you to an alternative safe country. Be that be where you've come from, if it's safe, like Albania or indeed Rwanda. That is the system. Is Rwanda ever going to happen? 